stay true to self. As Bryson Tiller would say anyway, when you are being true to yourself, you are completely honest with what you feel, deeply value, and desire. It also means communicating your feelings wholeheartedly, both with yourself and others, allowing your truth to flow through you and into the world. Someone is always going to see me as something, fake, real, loyal, or a liar. But I finally wrap my mind around the fact as to why does it matter? And as a Christian, why give in to worldly ways? Not going to lie, it's extremely hard. And I'm trying to find a way to overcome, bruh. Stop caring what others say and what they're thinking. If he's not worried about him, why are you worried for him? Why put yourself through the pain? You gotta make a mark on this world and it won't be by worrying and being about what everyone else is. Don't let them have that benefit of doubt. They don't deserve. Excel and shock those that forever put you down. I feel so much better in doing what makes me happy and giving myself these pep talks. Yes, people discourage, but shrug. And remember, it's all old news. If they worry, let them. Just know they still care. The more you cut off, the more you realize your worth. In my bag forever. Cause man, oh man. I had too many aha moments. You just have to pick yourself up because it'll be fine. So many lessons learned and it's really unbelievable. So many things that go through my head. I really do appreciate it all. All that betrayal has done brings tears to my eyes to think, shaking my head, just wow. I had a lot, but shaking my head. Just stay encouraged and keep your guard up for good reasons. And I think some people take that out of context. Just protect your heart. The key to so much. The battlefield is real. It's real dangerous, man. Protect your heart. And you can't do it all alone. Help might be needed, not directly from someone physically, because their intentions cannot be expectation. But God, God will definitely help you. He only wants what's best for you.